started. I, I, I did it again. Oh, jeez. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Blue Nuzlocke Run. I think this is part 11 or something. I don't even know. So, here's where we currently are. We have Austin, the Zubat, level 20. Jerry, the Beedrill, level 22. Manny, the Cat... No! Son of a... <laughs> oh, no! Oh, why did I do that? Oh, habit. I, I'm... Uh, I said it before and I'll say it again. I'm a creature of habit. Jeez. Uh, Manny, the Kadabra, very high speed and special. And Cole, the Pidgey. Second Pidgey I caught, but uh, the the last one I had already died. So, bec yeah, because of that reason alone is the only reason that I caught Cole. Otherwise, if, if I still had my other Pidgey, I would have just left it alone. And, uh, since it was the first one I ran into, yeah. I don't know if you can hear that, but I think my stepbrother's playing Modern Warfare downstairs. <laughs> I think I hear bullets fly or shooting. Somebody shooting bullets out of what sounds like a burst. An uh, auto, semi automatic burst. Submachine gun. I don't even know. <laughs> it's an AK 47 7A. I don't know. I don't know enough about guns to tell you that, even though I was raised in the redneck province of my country. Okay, so I want to get through this very quickly, so I think I'll I'll just leave Austin out there. He can take out this this po this uh, bug trainer. I think yeah, it's a bug trainer. I've never seen you around. Are you good? Oh man, you have no idea. I've only lost four Pokemon. Actually, hang on. One, two, uh, three, and maybe. I, 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 even, uh, I don't even know. I think it's around four. Oh yeah, you can't poison Austin. Austin is a poison subtype. So, uh, well, you could poison him, but you're probably not going to. And it, why is that Butterfree faster than Austin? Like, Zubats are supposed to be a fast Pokemon. Alright, come on. Yeah, thank you. Doing all the work for me. Come on. Ah, oh, jeez, look at that. Just, just be a dick. Or, no, I guess not. Oh, no! Austin, you fell asleep. Austin, wake up. Wake up, little Austin. Oh, God, no. No, 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 no! Oh, oh, oh my god! And he's still sleeping! Austin! Austin, what the hell, man? What the hell? Oh, oh. Holy crap, Austin. You almost died, and you don't even know it. Holy crap, guys. Really? Come on. That is so cheap. No! Oh, look at this, look at this! Yeah! Go call! Ha <laughs> uh, I knew you would come through for me. Oh, man. Austin, I... Why did you sleep through that? Oh, sweet! Confuse Ray has to be the best confusion move ever. You were too good! <laughs> I, I tried to tell you, but you wouldn't listen. Are my Pokemon weak, or am I just bad? You know what? I'll be honest with you, that that Butterfree is actually a pretty good Pokemon. You, you train it well. You just suck as a, a battler. That's all it is. Actually, no, you don't. You gotta get more Pokemon, man. You can't just have a Butterfly flying around your head. You gotta have, like, a bee and a bat and a bird and... Oh, so many bees. Holy crap. Like, uh, the, not... Not bees, as in the, the insect. Bees is in the letter. I am just an alliterating fool, aren't I? Alliterating? Is that a verb? I don't think so. Hmm. Alliteration? Where are you all alliterate? I, I didn't even know. Okay, okay. I'm bad with that kind of 
English, aren't I? Ah, jeez, okay. So, I'm... I feel like I'm behind in recording. I'm recording this the day before it's going up. I liked my system before, where I would record two days before, uh, edit, and then post it in the morning before I went to work, because it's, it just, it's really easy for me to just, when the video's ready, just upload it and set my, uh, my computer to turn off after it's done uploading, and then, oh, I get to read comments at lunch, and, well, actually, sometimes it's not very good, because <laughs> I actually had a really, uh, disgusting comment once, that, that was, uh, that kind of gross. But, <laughs> anyways, so I, you know what, I actually checked out this website called Yaush.com. It's like a, a Let's Playing community, and it's, it's really cool, actually, I like it. It's, well, it's not a, no, no, hang on, I'm sorry, it's not a Let's Playing community, it's a, I guess a gaming community, I would say, I don't know. But the people are there are very nice, and I get to learn a little bit more about other Let's Players, and I think it's just easier than going on YouTube and searching Let's Play to find new Let's Players. So, yeah. Okay. Getting a little bit off topic here. Pokemon Blue! Switch Manny with Cole. I don't want getting KO'd for sure. This girl has two Pidgeys and a Pidgeotto. Maybe. Oh, three Pokemon. What's the first one? Oh, it's a Pidgey. If I remember correctly, I would... Uh, okay, in Pokemon Fire Red, there was actually uh, the Versus Seeker where you could tr uh, re-battle trainers. And hey, nice. And I love to use that because uh, I would just sit here and battle these two trainers here, this girl and this guy, and I, I would just get a lot of experience for that. Uh, I want to switch to Austin because I don't want Manny to get too overpowered. Because level 24 is the next max that I can have, and already Jerry is almost level 20. Oh, it's another Pidgey. Jerry's already almost level 23, and Manny's probably almost 22 now after those two battles. Or, uh, Pidgeys. Just didn't work! What didn't work? I'm sorry, what was the question? I want to get stronger! What's your secret? My secret? Ah, uh, I can't... Uh, what, what's that reference I'm trying to think of? My secret? Is it, uh... Maybelline? No. Is it... Axe? No. I'm trying to think. What's your secret? No. Maybe it's maybe. I I can't think of it. Darn it. Oh, let's switch out. No, let's let's keep Manny out there. I don't want I don't want anybody getting hurt too badly. Oh, nice. Manny just one hit KOing everything. Uh oh. Uh uh. Uh uh. Oh crap, guys. Uh, at that level, Eradicate will have Hyper Fang. Oh, thank god! Okay. Just kill it. Thank you. Okay, if- I think if that thing had used Hyper Fang, Manny might have died. I didn't start it! What, start what? What was the question? I should carry more Pokemon with me for safety. You know what? That's a really good idea. I recommend it. I can't do it myself, but... No, I'd give it a try. Okay, so going in here... I'm the fishing guru. I simply love fishing. Do you like to fish? Yes, Mr. Black White Man. Grand, I like your style. Take this and fish, young one. Engine received old rod. Fishing is a way of life. From the seas to rivers, go out and land the big one, young one. Big one, young one, big one, young one. So, since you can't catch any Pokemon in towns, or yeah, since there's no grass in any towns, you can catch Pokemon in the water. And this is actually where I'm going to use that that little little uh, overlook in the Nuzlocke rules to catch a Pokemon here. And I'm sure all of you know already 
that I want a Magikarp. Oh yeah, here we go. Level 5, I think? Yeah. Oh well, that's that's okay. I I would rather have a nice... Uh, wait, how am I going to catch this thing? Oh shoot. Oh jeez, you guys. I just realized I'm not going to be able to hit this thing without killing it. Oh. I may have screwed up. Oh, <gasps> wait, no! Aha, I got this idea! <laughs> okay, so I disabled his splash. Now he's gonna start using struggle. Yes! This is genius! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh! Wow! I did not... I didn't even think of that before. That's so smart! <laughs> I use bide, and he struggles, and he hurts himself. Yeah, look at that. Oh, what? You struggle after you learned your move again? Alright. Let's try a Pokeball now. If it doesn't work, I gotta do it again. <laughs> yeah! Gotcha! Ah! <laughs> oh, yeah. So, I already know which name I'm gonna give it. Let's see here. In the distant past, it was somewhat stronger than the horribly weak descendants that exist today. Well, I guess people wouldn't name it Magikarp unless it was a strong mar uh, a strong mark a strong Pokemon in the past. So I'm gonna name you Mike after a very close friend of mine and another friend of mine. <laughs> Two good friends of mine are now named after one Pokemon. Two birds, one stone. All right, so heal up and. Uh, you know, I don't know what to do with Mike. Mike's just gonna hang out in the back of our group right now because he can't do anything. And if I train him now, I won't. I won't be doing that. You know, uh, picture in picture thing that I did, that, uh, that I did last time. I'm trying to find my words here, and it's. I just need a magnifying glass or something. Actually, hang on. I want to see you from the front. Hey, cool. So. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just uh, a little, not distracted, but uh, side, or uh, ADD, I don't know. But there was, I saw a post online, not not on YouTube, uh, uh, I can't remember, I think I tumbled onto it, and, or stumbled, I don't know, and anyways, it was, um, this person made this story about the guy at the Poke Gym, or all the Pokemon gyms. You know the guy that, uh, he's at all the Pokemon gyms, and you ask him about the gym, and he'll tell you, uh, like, uh, the, what it is, and what's good against their Pokemon. Oh, what? I don't have enough room? Ah, oh, come on. Uh, let's. Can I throw something? Do I need all of this? You know, I don't want to throw away anything. Oh, jeez, you guys. Should I use this? You know what, guys? I'm going to use this rare candy on Mike. Only because he's going to be hard to train. So, let's get this bike voucher. Come on. Ah, oh, we got to listen to him again, too. Well, you guys were listening to me while he was talking, so... Okay. <clears throat> so, the guy at the Pokemon gyms... The guy that tells you what kind of Pokemon you should use and what weaknesses and strong, super effective. It's uh, a really, really sad story, actually. <laughs> it's completely fictional. It's not. It's not. Any, it doesn't have anything to do with the game, I think. And so, basically, that guy in the story is actually Red's father, or. Well, actually, yeah, Red's father, this, your character is actually Red in the game, not Ash, and not, not whatever you name him, certainly. And, uh, he ran away, he, he was overwhelmed by the fact that he got his wife pregnant, and, uh, there was other, thing go other things going on. Uh, Professor Oak actually asked him, instead of, uh, he actually asked him first to go out and catch Pokemon for him, and then he found out his wife was pregnant, and he got overwhelmed, and he ran away, and, 
uh, when he found out that his that his son Red was on a Pokemon journey, he decided that he would in secret help out his help out Red by going to every gym and telling him what to do or how to win. But ah, oh, it was it was such a cool story. Like it it's those fan made Pokemon stories. I really like them. It's it's so cool sometimes. A bike voucher. Okay, here you go. You better make a. God damn it! Ah! Wait, no! Take my bike voucher. I just picked up the bike voucher, so I could get a bike for it. Please, just exchange what I have. So then it makes room. Ah! Oh, damn. What a what a silly game design. You gotta have something you're exchanging. You have to have an extra slot for it. Okay, let's see. Let's. Let's dump all of these TMs in here, because I don't think I can use any of them right now. Although, I will hold on to uh, Bubble Beam for sure, because when Mike grows to level 20 and becomes a Gyarados, he's going to need that uh, water move. Well, he doesn't need it, but still, it's nice to have. Okay, uh, how many more? One more? Yeah, there we go. I'm gonna have to use that full of store sometime. Okay, there, finally. You know, I should have put in uh, that fossil too. That would have been a good idea. Oh well. Okay, uh, over here. Alright, talk to me, fool. Your sunglasses wearing, cheapo. Engine exchange the bike voucher for the bicycle. Yes! Now I can zip around really fast. Take on cycling roads and in caves. I would not recommend going into a cave with a bike, but you can certainly do it. Let's see, switch the bicycle with the antidotes, I guess, I don't really need the antidotes. Alright, here we go guys! Yeah, we're really speeding along now, this will make the game a little bit faster, a little bit more bearable. Actually, I don't even know what I got done in this episode and how much time I have, uh, let's see, give it a quick glance. Oh yeah, I got lots of time left. Let's see. <laughs> oh yeah, I got lots of time. I mean, it's only 17 minutes into the recording. 17 and a half, rather. 17 minutes and 38 seconds. Probably. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna cut anything out, so... Hey. Guess what? I'm gonna ride my bike indoors. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh. But yeah, like, there's so many cool Pokemon things online that, uh, the fans make. Like, okay, okay, guys. You know... <laughs> I never thought of this before, okay? But I remember seeing something online about, uh, your character being on the bike. Okay, so, face down and stand still. He's got a boner. <laughs> oh, man. What? Oh, jeez. What what were the animators thinking? No, don't don't kill my Pokemon. Oh, I I said no. I heard a beep. Ah, never mind. Okay, so so what shall we do, guys? Should we go on the SSN or should we go to Roots? What's its name? Because we haven't. We could catch another Pokemon at the next route. Where is it? Uh, right. No. Come on. Where is that route? There we go. Route 11. I can catch a new Pokemon at Route 11. And a Diglett, even. Or maybe a Doug Trio in Diglett Cave. You know what? Let's go do that. Let's go find a new Pokemon to catch. Mm. Going here. What do you gotta say, buddy? What a surprise! Diglett's dug this long tunnel! It goes straight to Viridian City! Oh, pretty cool. Actually, it goes straight to Viridian Forest. Well, like, kind of south of Peter City, but... Anyways, uh, let's see. Who should I send out? You know what? Cole. Go Cole. If I'm right... Uh, these Diglets will have Scratch, and that, that's pretty much it. That does not look good. Okay, there we go. Diglett, level 20. Really? Wow. That would be a really nice addition to the team, guys. Let's, uh... Let's do a sand attack, maybe? Oh, 
dude, she's oh my god, Cole! Whoa, buddy! Whoa! Just calm down. And and we'll talk this through. Alright, go Austin. You gotta make up for Oh yeah, look at that. Lucky day, lucky day. Let's see if we are faster. No, we're we're slower than Diglett. So this could potentially work in our favor. Uh, let's see here. It hurt itself. That's very good, very good. Oh god! I'm glad I used Leech Life and not Bites. That should certainly do a lot of damage. Okay, let's... We've got six Pokeballs, so... Hopefully Diglett doesn't kill itself while it's confused. Oh, alright! There we go! Yeah! Got it! Diglett! Now! What do I name you after? Um... Lives about one yard underground, where it feeds on plant roots. It sometimes appears above ground. I would hope so, I mean... It needs to breathe air, right? So, you know what? I'm gonna name you after one of my very early childhood friends. Uh, mm -hmm. There we go, Colton. Colton was a... Like, one of my first friends ever. I, I, I cannot... My earliest memories are... Uh, I like from my earliest memories I can always remember him so one one of the few friends I have that's like that very few like because my memory is really bad too so so I've forgotten I'm sorry to to all of my friends but I I've, I've forgotten I have forgotten people it's really sad actually so, I think I'll end the video off after catching Colton, and I want to thank you all for watching. If you want to tell me what you think, leave a comment. If you want to show me what you think, leave a comment. If you like some other videos, subscribe. Or you can PM me if you do not want to leave a comment. You can ask me how my day was. You can tell me how your day was. You can ask me any questions you have about emulators or uh, how to let's play. Because I, I are a good let's player. Absolutely. <laughs> Uh, what do you guys say? I'm putting up this building on this plot of land! My Pokemon is tamping the land! The tamping? What do you mean? Wah! Go, 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 Machop. A Machop is stomping the land flat. A Machop? Is stomping the land? Machop is not a big one. Or uh, Pokemon. I keep calling them monsters, damn! <sighs> okay. Common question of the episode. Um. Hmm. Here's a good one. If you could be any of the uh, protagonists in any of the Pokemon games, which one would you be? Me? Oh, jeez. Uh, I would have to say, even though Pokemon Blue is my favorite of... Uh, yeah, okay, yeah. Pokemon Blue is probably my favorite of all of the, of the Pokemon games. But I think that I would much rather be silver, or not silver, is it silver or gold? Um, no, it's probably gold. Cool. Gold from the second generation, the male protagonist of that. And I only say that because I would really uh, like to see, like to be in the, like, uh, the future of the second generation. Like, 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 totally. Because, just just think about it, like, Team Rocket was disbanded, and uh, there's all these cool Pokemon, and uh, you even got uh, more stuff to do, like, you can give your Pokemon items, and there's actual specials, and a little bit more strategy in the game, and there's more stuff to do than just run around and battle trainers. It's, yes, yes, I would say the second generation protagonist would be who I would want to be in a Pokemon game. In real life, rather. So, again, thank you all for watching. If you want to tell- or- I said that. Again, thank you all for watching. Until next time, I will see you all then.